hello everyone welcome back to the map of mathematics in this video we are going to solve this nice math lumped geometric problem and here we have cube root of 2 plus square root of 5 plus cube root of 2 minus square root of 5 and we will simplify this problem uh, and uh, we got this answer in a reducible form so that uh, the very first thing we are going to do is here first uh, we uh, denote this uh, uh, question by uh, some uh, capital letter or small uh, alphabet and we see that uh, y equals to cube root of 2 plus uh, square root of 5 plus cube root of 2 minus uh, square root of 5 so uh, now we suppose our given equation or given question in equals to y and uh, we take the right hand side is equals to a plus b so it means that we take 2 plus square root 5 cube root equals to a and we take 2 minus square root 5 cube root equals to b so this is our y it is equals to a plus b and now in the next step uh, we will uh, take uh, cube on both of the sides of this equation so uh, now we write here we take cube on both of the sides and you get y cubed equals to a plus b whole cubed so now we use here the nice cubic formula and uh, we apply this formula on the right hand side and you get a cubed plus b cubed plus 3 times of AB into A plus B so here we use the cubic formula on the right hand side of this equation so now we uh, put the values of A and B here so we know that the value of A is uh, this one and the value of B is this one so uh, when we substitute these two values here then you see that this cube and cube root are cancelled by each other and similarly this cube and cube root are cancelled by each other and we just get its base so uh, we have 2 plus square root of 5 and we have this plus sign and we have b cubed so uh, this cube root and cube are cancelled by each other and we obtain 2 minus square root of 5 and here you have plus 3 times of a b so the value of a is uh, cube root of uh, 2 plus uh, square root of 5 and the value of b is cube root of 2 minus square root of 5 and here you have a plus b and we denote a plus b equals to y so uh, this will be equals to y so that now we uh, make a little bit simplifications here and you see that this negative and positive term are cancelled by each other and we add the like terms so you have 2 plus 2 is 4 and here you have plus 3 times of here you see that we have cube root on both of the terms and these two terms are multiplied by each other so that we will combine the cube root of uh, these two terms and we write in this way uh, it will be equals to 2 plus uh, square root of 5 into 2 minus uh, square root of 5 and we write the cube root in this form in exponential form so uh, here uh, we need uh, to uh, make a little bit simplifications here so that we have 4 plus 3 times here you see that uh, it is 2 plus square root 5 and 2 minus square root 5 so it is equals to that 2 squared minus 5 square root and its whole square so here we use this nice square identity so according to this identity we write it as 2 square minus square root of 5 and its whole square and uh, its uh, equals to and its whole uh, power 1 over 3 and here you have y it is multiplied by here and here so now uh, here we make little bit simplifications and we have 4 plus 3 times of uh, you have 2 square is 4 minus this 2 and square root are gone and we get 
minus 5 and its whole power 1 over 3 into y so in the left hand side we have y cubed so uh, in the next step we write y cubed equals to 4 plus 3 times of here we have 4 minus 5 is minus 1 and its whole power 1 over 3 into y so you know that uh, the cube root of minus 1 uh, equals to uh, minus 1 so we have 4 minus 3 times of y equals to y cubed so in the next step we rearrange the terms and we move all the terms in the right hand side to the left hand side so it will becomes y cubed plus 3y minus 4 equals to 0 so here you see that we get a cubic equation so here we write again this as y cubed plus 3y minus 4 equals to 0 so now we solve this cubic equation and we find uh, the roots of this cubic equation so that uh, here we just uh, break the middle term of this cubic equation so we have plus 3 and we write it as y cubed and uh, this plus 3 will be equals to minus y and plus 4y we break this 3y as minus y plus 4y and this is minus 4 equals to 0 so uh, here uh, first we take common y on the first two terms and we get y squared minus 1 and here we take common plus 4 and we get 4 times of y minus 1 equals to 0 so in the next step uh, we again use here the nice uh, square identity on this factor so you get here y times of y minus 1 into y plus 1 and here we have 4 times of y minus 1 equals to 0 so now uh, you see that y minus 1 be the common factor so we take it common and you get y minus 1 times of uh, here you have y and we multiply this y on these two terms and you get uh, y squared plus y and here we take common y minus 1 and we get plus 4 equals to 0 so in the next step we uh, have two cases here so our first case is we write y minus 1 equals to 0 and the second case is we write y square plus y plus 4 equals to 0 so in the first case we get the first real solution of the given question which is y equals to 1 and now in order to find the other solutions we uh, just uh, need to solve this quadratic vein so uh, here we have first write the coefficients of this equation so it has a equals to 1 b equals to 1 and c equals to 4 and the quadratic formula will be looks like in this form minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of a c over 2 times of a so here we put the values of a b and c in this quadratic formula and we move towards the other solutions so we have minus b the value of b is minus 1 plus minus square root of 1 minus 16 over 2 and when we simplify these terms then you get minus 1 plus minus square root of minus 15 over 2 so uh, here uh, you have the values of uh, y equals to minus 1 plus minus square root of 15 into iota over 2 so here you have these two are the complex solutions so this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos